Hi, everybody. I got some new pens. Yay. And I kind of cheated and opened them already because I was too excited, but I have not tried them yet. And I've gotten some other pens um, in before this that I want to show you too. I know. For my pen aficionados out there, they get it. What I'm going to be using to write on today is a Moleskine, Moleskine, Moleskin, however you would like to pronounce it. it makes no difference to me. Moleskine notebook. And here are the list of the pens that I got. Line them up here. Energel. One. Shell blue. There. Let's see, any ball. One point six. Here. Let's see. Green and a hybrid gel. I'm going to be very interested to try those. Day energy point oh red and a hybrid gel ink. Violet, metallic red. I don't think these are all going to fit next to their listings. We'll see. The Pilot Juice. These are all one millimeter or bigger. The Hybrid again, metallic pink. <clears throat> Got the Orofuda red, sateen rollerball, and then a rollerball in black. It's 1.5 millimeters. Energel red. 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 in red and a hybrid metallic in bronze. ballpoint but it's got a thicker or a bigger ink tank and then we've got the last pilot juice okay what should we try first I guess we start at the top and work our way down is the so let's 
start off here with the, I don't know if you'll see that, probably won't, no, the pilot, pilot juice. really smooth very nice it's better than I thought it would be sure the blue is the same most merry pretty awesome probably shouldn't open all these up A little scratch here for some reason, me. But nevertheless, still good. So I've got the three pilot juice I'm gonna try. Next is the my favorite pens, the Pentel Liquid Gel Ink Energel. This is a Deluxe gel pad. Mm. Very nice. Love them. I think this whole this whole carousel here is probably going to be Energels now. This is the Pentel Energel Euro Gel Pen. Hmm. like that. I think I may like the liquid gel ink better. And now the lovely Odo pens. If you haven't tried Odo pens, I don't know what you're waiting for. Uh-oh. There we go. Started off a little rough, but as you see, the ink is starting to get down into the reservoir, and it's starting to do that. It's got a little guide so you can see how much ink you have left. I don't know what that says. No idea. Pigment ink, water-based. Water, no, water and fade-proof. Look at that. And let me down. This is the Odo Foodaball 1.5 again. Oops. It's a Satine ball. This is, I don't know what the difference is. Wow. Yep, it's a good one. All right, here's one I really want to try. Sparkling metallic lines. It's a Pentel hybrid gel, which I don't know what that means. Pigment gel, capped after using. Avoid 
tapping to revive ink, keep writing. I don't know. I have not seen oh, these are made in Japan as well. Medium 1.0 ball metallic violet. Hmm, that's what I thought. I saw that coming. Black, black look. It takes a little while to dry, but as a child, oops, <laughs> as a kid, I learned to curve my hand all goofy so I don't hit the ink. So that doesn't really bother me that much. Let's see what the red looks like. I don't know why I keep crossing my L's. Hmm. Not as exciting as I thought. So far, my favorites have to be these two and the Ohos. But, oh, that's nice. Very vibrant. And bronze, which you don't see all the time. And last but not least, the blue. Kind of a neat blue. Oh, not your everyday blue. We're gonna do the any ball five hundred one. I got this because it was a one point six. So let's see what a one point six writes like. It's like slippery. It's crazy. doesn't feel like it's got that thick of a line and I think it depends how hard you push but um, kind of line that you get but it does feel slippery it feels like it's on an air hockey table or something and last but not least is the power tank, the uni. Now this is only a one and it's a ballpoint, so. A little smearing with the uni ball. Still and that's been sitting a while, so. much of that. That's been sitting there for a second. Look at the smearing on it. So your mileage may vary. Now next, um, I've seen this one before. This is one of my, still, this is still one of my favorites. It's where I got, I think, a pack of 12 from Amazon. And they do smear a bit. Uh, but I still like them. And the bold 207s, you can just get these usually in any Office Depot or Staples. It's a one millimeter gel. Not the best, but you know, if you like one millimeters and you're in a pinch, it's a good pen. Um, that you can just pick up nearly anywhere. Roll and Rock, one of my favorites, still. Love it. 
and some Unibar bolts. Gotten this too. This is a another. I believe this is another Unibar Air made Japan. I think it will write. But look at the tip of it. It's very cool looking. So it's just looks like a cone. I can't even see where the tip is because they made it black. But I think these will write like upside down and sideways and every way till Sunday. So I do like this pen. Um, the tools we've been through before are still up there on my list. Surprisingly, they just still staying up on my list. Um, at, this is a thing, thing tie on, thing tie on. And it's still a good one. Don't like it as much as the roll mock. Got some tools. They come in such a variety of colors, so it's kind of cool. But you just buy them in the pack of, I don't know, I think it's 14. A neat one. Um, this is a Uni 1.0 uh, red by the Mitsubishi Pen Company. It doesn't have that thick of a line because it's just in um, ballpoint again. It's a jet stream. If you remember, um, I do like the jet stream pens. Pilot Multi Ball. Now this feels scratchy to me, and it is scratchy. Um, it might be less than, I don't know what the millimeter is on this, but Pilot doesn't seem to make a whole heck of a lot of thick um, white tips. the Energel. I'm getting messed up. This is a 7. It's going to be over there. Another Uniball Air. This is a Uniball, pardon my hands, I was working all day. Uniball Signal. These are kind of like um, these bolts. But broad, sorry. These are United States pens. And these are made in Japan. Uh, another jet stream in a color. And I think these are only these are the one millimeter again, but they came in color, so I wanted to try those. Although I do like I remember the jet streams. with the caps better, much better. I don't know why, it could be psychological. Just stream, this is, oh, I got them in red. And blue. Signal. Okay, here come my babies. Energo. Love that. Love this pen. I love this pen very much. What? I got all over these.
for Jetstream 1.0. I came in and I got them in three colors. Stream and Pilot and Red Jet Stream Got the Pointos again Some Extras and then this like a darker blue again made in Japan and lastly, there's this guy. This is just a brush pen, but I really like it. Very um, bold one. There's another Uni 1.0. It's a ballpoint, so again, it's not quite as thick. But here are my super, super favorites. For Odo's. Got nearly all the colors. second but this is the pen I carry with me every day and it's just a Energel. I don't want to scratch it which is sad. How did I do that? And there's oh no it's just got something on it. Good. <laughs> and it's got a 1.0 just like these guys but it's my everyday carry in my purse. And I've had it, knock on wood, for over two weeks, which is exciting for me because I haven't lost it. So, yeah, I really, really like this pen. And as into the Odo, these are Fuda Ball 1.5, Satine Ball. Okay, here's a Fuda Ball. This is just in red. I just need a second to jump up and get going, but check these out. These are 1.5s of odd. Oto 1.5s. Look at that. Oh. These are just like, they're like butter. So many colors. How exciting. I haven't been using them a lot because I don't want them to run out of ink. Because <laughs> I like them a lot. I should store them horizontal and not up and down. So I should probably change that. Oh. 
I have to break out my toolbox again. So, the bolt points I can store up and down, no problem. So, I've got the pilot juice. These came in, unfortunately, I was very, very hopeful with these. These kind of came in a little low, so I'm going to put these in here. I'm going to store them this way, and we'll see what happens there. Nice thing is... Perfectly. Okay. I know I have some other ballpoints that see what else I can find for ball points but that's about it I think my favorites today still hold on um Fuda my everyday pen of course Fuda's Oto's
Desert Island, I would want all of these pins with me, and if that Desert Island was hell, I would have no paper. Always can count on me to be optimistic. Third place just for the colors themselves, and they do work pretty well. So as for gel pens, those are I line up in these. enjoyed and uh, I will talk to you soon probably not about pens next time I hope everyone's hanging in there and is safe and sound and um, have a great night great day great week great month you get it we'll speak soon thanks